going on, everybody? Welcome to Rips Card Rips. It is Thursday night. We are ready to rip 24 Heritage Major League Baseball full case break. This is the uh, the auctions ended for this about an hour and a half ago on eBay. Thank you, everybody, for your quick payments. I appreciate it. Crunch, what's up, man? How are you? P. Pence, what's going on? We'll get started here about two minutes after the hour. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you are a returning customer, welcome back. We are live on Instagram and on YouTube. We'll run the full case. We'll do a recap at the end of all the hits, autos, relics, etc. Eric is here. What's going on? Yeah, Crunch, we sold out. Sold out. All the auctions sold. Everybody's paid, so we're in good shape. I appreciate you. If you love this product, feel free to help me out. If you think we miss a variation, there's so many different variations in this. I've never actually ripped this product by the case before, so we'll run through it. But if you think I missed something in the live and you want me to go back, just let me know. We'll need everybody's help hunting the flip stocks, the color swaps. The nickname should be pretty easy to find, but uh, some of the parallels and variations throwback uniforms, stuff like that. If I miss one of those, uh, going through the cards, we show every card and we do ship every card. But if we miss one of those, just let me know in the live. Either way, it's going to get shipped to you. But if we, we do want to recognize all the, uh, all the variations in the live, if we can catch them. So it's a team effort here with that. It's a really good group, really good chat, usually over on Instagram. You're welcome to watch on Instagram or on YouTube. And we will run the case in about two or three minutes. If you have any questions over the course of the break, just let me know down in the comments section. If you wanted to let me know who you are rooting for, by all means. <laughs> Jackson Holiday over eight. Yeah, lots of his cards are getting sold right now too. Everybody's buying. Everybody likes to buy at peak. I don't quite understand that, but hey. Do you? Uh, there's multiple uh, MVPs and dual cards in this product. In about a minute or so, I'm going to roll this 12-sided dice. John, what's going on? Um, the way that this works is any uh, different borders of those would go to whoever wins this dice roll. So uh, 1 through 6 would go to the player on the left. 7 through 12 would go to the player on the right. If for the base cards of those, there's probably going to be multiple of all of them. So if there's an odd number, the extra one will go to whoever wins this dice roll. Yeah, Churio looks good. Churio looks real good. The game got postponed today. I wanted to bet the Brewers today. I'll probably bet Freddie again tomorrow. Yeah, it helps. Certainly helps the old pitchers when you can score some runs, huh? I wanted to bet Freddie today. Mr. Hollis, what's going on? Uh, here's the dice roll, y'all, for the uh, for the dual player cards. Again, I'll I'll distribute them evenly between if there's two different players on them. If there's four, each player will get two. This dice rolls for any of the odd numbers. So if there's five, whoever wins the dice roll will get three. And if there's any um, different borders of those, whoever wins the dice roll will get those. Zero through six, player on the left. Seven through 12 on the right. Good luck. That's a three. So any of the... Parallels of the dual player cards would go to the player on the left. But again, we'll even out the base. Any odds will go to that one as well. Underground, what's going on? Jay Randazzo, what's going on? You got some good spots tonight. What's going on, Justin? How are you? Looks like we got like 25 in the live, which is a good number. I'm going to pop the case, get the boxes sorted out. We'll get started here momentarily. Again, so many different variations in this. If I miss one, please help me out. I have not ripped a ton of heritage in my illustrious breaking career. It's never been a product that I have ripped. So help me make sure we don't miss any, any of the variations. Either way, all the cards are going to ship to you. But again, having not ripped it, I may not recognize a flip stock or a color swap until I get my bearings down on where all the, what all the colors are. So we'll figure it out. Again, we're live on YouTube and Instagram. If you have any questions, just let me know down in the chat. I bet this will be between an hour and a half and two hours on the break. What's up, Phil? Preparing for a show this weekend? Nice. I thought you were going to say preparing for UFC 300 this weekend. All right. 12 boxes here. Here we go. Again, we'll rip the full case. We'll do a recap at the end. 
The white borders are easy to spot. Yeah, those I'll, those I'll be able to catch, I think. Good luck, y'all. Again, help me find the variations if I miss them. Box topper, Jim Palmer. Looks like all the action is in the second to last card spot. Looks like a lot of the base short prints are backwards and make it easy for us. So we'll see. Good luck. Good luck, good luck, good luck. Again, we'll try to get this, get through this in less than two hours for you. Arginini, what's going on? Here we go. Stephen Kwan. Boy, is he off to a nice start this year. Ronnie Mauricio, Veerling, Taj, Taiwan Walker. Highlights, Ronald Acuna, Schoendeist. Yeah, I'm, I was watching, uh, I sure did, Phil. It's nice of them to realize that nobody was buying it and then immediately cut the price and devalue their own product. There's a Caminero, Mullins, Jonathan Joseph, India. I don't know if that's a color swap or anything. 239, what's going on? Ryder Ryan, there are some new names in this that weren't in Series 1, which is cool. World Series. Willie, there's a white border Goldie. That's easy to find. Jared Triolo. Okay. I was able to spot that one. Good start. Good start. Hey, Phil, maybe if they just priced the product the right way from the beginning, it would have just sold out, and then <laughs> they would have continued to raise the demand going into the next product. But that would have been too easy. You Darvish, Otani base, Buxton Grisham, Pablo Lopez. No cards one through 100. Yeah, so that's 26. So that's going to be a short print. Corbin Carroll. Poster Pete, what's up? NFL Breaks, what's up? Oswaldo. Brendan Donovan. Drew Waters. Tukey Toussaint, I'm guessing that's something special, but I don't know. Tukey Toussaint. Anybody know? Bobby Miller. Oh, yeah, that doesn't have an auto on it. There we go. Okay. So it's always the hit seems to always be in that spot. No auto on that one. No auto there, Tukey. I caught that one, Eric. Look at that. Nice angle signing. They must have got some uh, James Outman. They must have got some of the uh, – there's a news flashback. Somebody got that whole spot. Jaws. My kid will love that card. D-Sweet. Dusty Baker. Brandon Williamson. Jameson Tyone. How many autos per case are you guys seeing on this stuff? Framber Valdez. Odds don't suggest a ton of them. Cole Reagans. McNeil. I don't know if there's anything special about the Reagans. Oh, he's a short print, isn't he? 120. Cole Reagans. Yeah, I don't know why they can't get those guys to sign. That one doesn't, does it? I guess it does. I don't know what the heck that thing is. I, I guess there is an auto. There is a no auto variation, right? I thought that was one of them. So yeah. This stuff is confusing. I know it's one of I know people love to collect this stuff. But for me it's tough to uh tough to want to rip into stuff <laughs> that I don't know what I don't know what it is. Ryan McMahon, SP. Yeah, I don't think that one's ever getting signed, but that's a heck of a card. Casey Schmidt, Real Muto, Relic, League Leaders, Yandi, and Arise. Real Muto. Every box was a Relic in a quarter case. Yeah, and you should get, what, one hot box per? Real Muto, Relic. 
Anybody seen anything crazy? Anybody seen a Soto Auto yet? Has that big auto chase been pulled yet? Yogi Berra, Wisniewski, then and now, Morgan and Soto. That's a cool card. Mookie. There's some real, real weirdos that come into the chat on YouTube. Good Lord. Eli Morgan, Guardians. I'm guessing that's some sort of a variation, but again, all cards do ship. Nice. Jordan Adams. Benintendi. Lopez Hap. Ben Joyce. Tatis. Don Fletcher. Phil, you're going to laugh when you see the one. You're going to really laugh hard when you see it. It's, un it's one of the... It's clever, to say the least. Mitch Garver. Short print. Noel B. Marte. Dalton Varsho. Trev, what up, man? You ready to see a lot of cards? You're in the right spot. Salvi Perez. Arise. Earl Weaver. Flashbacks. Is that Lou Brock? Yep. Bradish. How are we doing, Trev? What's going on? Dylan Carlson, Martin Maldonado, SP. <laughs> you could you could put it that way. I guess it all kind of depends on what's uh, what's coming out of here. Estevez, there's a Joey Weimer white border. Two of those in there. <laughs> Phil, I knew you'd get a kick out of that. I, it was hard for me not to get a kick out. I was like, what the? What is wrong with people? Imagine taking the time out of your day because, like, you know that guy didn't just come into my room. Like, he's going into every room trying to get a reaction with that stuff. Bo Bichette, insert. Breakersville, what's up? Alec Thomas. Rafaela. Berger, Kyle Gibson, Gabriel Arias, Guardians. I think there was two different ones, so one of those was a color swap. Got to memorize what the color pattern is, which I'm not smart enough to do that after just one. Jose Tania. Terror of Pooh. What's going on? It's a good name. Bryce Terang. Ooh, Jordan Westberg out of 375. Chrome, that's nice. The Chromes are nice. I was hoping to hit some of these. I don't know how often these hit, but I like that. Westberg out of 375. Very nice. All right, box one. A couple of, what, white borders or relic? Who knows what else is in there, but they're all shipping. So, again, if anybody catches a short print that we don't see, you want me to go back, just let me know. Again, I've never ripped a full case of this stuff before, so I'm learning as we go. There's a nice Nolan Ryan box topper. What's that, Anthony? For a Bobby Valentine auto, that'd be cool. Let's see what we got. Two of those. I don't know what that Tukey Toussaint was, but hey. Who knows? Seven, what's up? Ooh, hot box. <laughs> I thought someone would get a kick out of that. Hot box coming. Abrams, Kevin Newman, Veerling, and Trey Turner. Chrome, purple. How does the price of this compare to Series 1? It's almost the same. Ronald Acuna Jr. White Border. That's a nice one. Pete Alonzo. Purple. 
That's a nice one right there. Nice Ronald. Very nice. Do the hot boxes usually yield an auto or are they just full of chrome, purple chrome? Otani, Taiwan Walker, and Riley Green. Ari's cards, what's up? If you're new here, your cards will get to you safely and securely. I don't sleeve and top load every single card that will be sleeved and loaded when it ships to you during the live break. Otherwise, we'd keep you here for way longer than you need to be. Harrison Bader, short print. Chrome, Clayton Kershaw. Purple. Purples are nice. Big checklist, so it's tough to tough to catch the name you're looking for. Mad Max, purple. Ari, what's up? If you guys love this, I have one more case that's running tomorrow night. We'll have five cases of tops. We'll have five cases of tops chrome black running at some point next week. News flashbacks. Lance Lynn and George Springer. And we'll have, I think, seven cases of Bowman, all different varieties, early May when that comes out on the baseball end. So if you're a baseball fan, we got all sorts of fun stuff coming. Generally, I know most, I know quite a bit about most of these products, but this is a new one for me. So forgive me as I learn the product. Yeah, the Chrome Black Checklist just dropped tonight, Eric. I just was looking through it. It's awesome. I don't recall if you're going to be happy with it or not. But you can take a look real quick. Brian Wu. B. Wu. Nice rookie purple. Checklist looks good, though. Some cool dual autos. They got some inserts in there. I like it. I always love that product. Uh, better that than this, to be honest, Phil. Candelario, Jordan Adams. Nice rookie purple. Better that than this. That, at least I know what I'm looking at. This will take me a little bit more time with all the dual cards and all that stuff. Oh, which card was it? Bryce Jarvis. Nito. Giloff. Mackenzie Gore. Short print. Emmett Sheehan. Andy Rod Auto. Andy Rod Auto. Oh, it almost slipped right by me. Blue Ink Auto, Andy Rodriguez. Andy Rodriguez, congrats to the Andy spot. Altman, Brent Rooker. Verdugo, Yelly, Enrique, and Lindor. So the hot box hit us with an auto. That's nice. Juan Pablo. Spees. Kyle Higashioka. Luis Matos is a nice one. They're saving him for either Series 2. He'll probably lead Series 2. I like the way you worded that. Kyle Harrison. Ooh, nice Yuri Perez at a 375. I like that. Clay Holmes and Quinn Priester. Yuri at a 375. The silver chrome or the chrome, whatever these are called. Chrome silver at a 375 are nice. Very nice. Yuri Perez. Yeah, they sure do. They sure do. Winans. Jaws again. Zach Eloff. Nice one there. Medio. This is a big checklist, I imagine. 
I imagine set builders probably have a ball going after some of the variations and stuff. Goldschmidt. How many hot boxes are there per case? Just one? Jordan. Lane Thomas, Caminero, Bryson Stott. Marte, just one, came early. Matos, Witt, Fernando Tatis, Mullins, and Garrett Cole, NL All-Star. Couple of fielder's choices, or do you get doinked with one? Yogi Berra, Yogi Berra, white border. Mookie Betts is a nice one. Nice Yogi. Lawler rookie, Aaron Judge is a nice one. Samad Taylor, Giancarlo Stanton. It's an SP, it's card 33, Yoshida. B. Wu. Dane Myers and Kikuchi. I bet that guy yesterday, and he got he got beat up a little bit. Evan Carter, Murgy, what's up, man? Rafaela Lindor, Buxton, and Gunnar Henderson. Pretty nice start for your guards there, Murgy. Pretty nice start to the year. All right, two boxes down. Again, if you just joined us, we'll run the case. We'll do a recap at the end. If you think we miss a variation, please feel free to let me know to go back. Just learning the product for the first time. Jordan Lawler, box topper. Those will ship to you in the correct top loader as well. So we get some of those in. I always forget which products are going to have box toppers, but remember this time... Box three. All right. Andy Rodriguez, the first auto out of the case. That would be awesome. I would love that for you. Romano, Kyle Edward Finnegan, SP. You know they do that just to entertain themselves. Victory leaders. LeMahieu, Bogarts, Mejia, Trey Turner. Ellie De La Cruz, white border. Nice one for the Ellie spot. That gets us going a little bit. What's that card worth? What's that one worth? That's got to be a pretty darn nice hit. Congrats to the Ellie spot. Granky and Wicks. O'Neill Cruz call Carlson. Paredes SP. Garrett Mitchell. They definitely are cool. I like the cards. I like the chromes a lot more. I'm not a big paper cards guy. John Gray, Arcia, 
Not really into paper cards really at all, but I definitely dig the chrome versions of these. Be nice to catch a low numbered one of those out of this case. Burger, Devers, Bob, Bichette. 35 bucks, that's it? With this big a checklist, that's gonna be a damn hard card to hit. Horowitz, Basab, Chris Stratton, Cabbage. Freddie Freeman. Severino, white border. Seaver, Gandhi. Bone, Drury, SP, and Canzone. Bueller, Freilich, Kirstad, Gossman, and Strider. Mookie and Adley. Bybee and J Mart. Devin Sweet. Brennan Rogers, SP, Michael Harris. Contreras, you asked for a Contreras patch. TJ Friedel. I think you wanted the 101, but at least you got one. You got a patch. Look at that. Look at that. It is not the one of one, but it is the card that you requested. Luis Castillo. Yes, sir, it is. Mason Wynn, rookie. You Darvish. Felix Bautista, SP. Rosario. Got to get the base first and then go for it. I don't think I've seen the Freddy Peralta yet. Does he just have inserts or autos or does he have a base? I don't think I've seen the base. I don't know what that is. In that spot, probably just an insert. That was a pretty good call. Give me a Contreras patch. Boom. Contreras patch. Otani. Dick Williams. D. Will. He's got a base SP. I'm sure we'll hit that. Julio. News flashbacks. Steven Kwan. Kwan's off to a nice start, huh, Murgy? Joe Rye. Higashioka. SP. Andrew Abbott. Kowser. Nito. That's a black border. First one of those. Soto, Marte. All right, three boxes down. Some nice pulls so far. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. Let's get something crazy. Something to get the, the chat going. Looking like just under two hours. What is that? Tim Foley, 50th anniversary.
Tim Foley 50th anniversary. Is that an original card? What the hell that is? You guys will know. Tim Foley. If you got the Tim Foley spot, the odds of hitting that probably aren't very good. So congrats. I don't know what the hell that is. <laughs> Obviously, Taylor's thinking. I don't know what the hell he's thinking. I don't know what that was. I don't know what that is. It's a Tim Foley, the 50th anniversary stamp on it. I'm guessing it's an original. Who knows? Rowdy Telez SP. Bye back. kind of expected that they would like throw that in a top loader or something tyler stevenson g will they just flopped it right in there nothing just threw it in there forest wall white border yeah it sure does Forest wall. Let's see some chrome action. I think that's where I think that's what I'm looking for. I want to see a red ink auto. How hard are the red ink autos to hit? Bobby Witt, Bailey, Tark, Scooble, Cron. Anybody watch the Masters today? Boy, I hope Scotty Shuffler doesn't run away with it. God, am I sick of watching that dude win? Kodai Senga, Tyler Wells. Dude hits it in the water on 13. It bounces out. It still makes birdie. Tyler Rogers, Corey Lee, Juan Pablo. Ronald. Nolan Jones. Fully played 15 seasons. Did those 15 seasons allow someone to bid 99 cents on that spot is the question. Bednar, Shanwell. I want a lot of people on me. I hit 25 in 15 seasons. Sheesh. Brett Batty. White Border. Bellow. Uh, nothing besides base so far, Joe, on Caminero. But we got eight boxes and some change left, so hang out. Maybe you'll, maybe you'll bring some good luck to yourself. There he is. Mookie. I saw him, Kim. It's almost two a year. Yeah, he was a power hitter. I'd like to see those two home runs that he hit, too. They probably were. Freddie Peralta, there he is. Base SP, that's a cool photo. Austin Meadows. Freddie P. Yelich. Luis Matos. Ellie De La Cruz, first base Ellie. I told you we'd get you that card. You had to get that one. Bernie Superman, what's up? Dane Myers, another news flashback. Tommy Edmond. Quan and Carnacion Strand. James Altman. I got to look at the other Tukey that I thought was something special because it obviously wasn't. Curtis Mead on the back. Again, all cards ship. We'll get these out to you within a couple business days, like always. If you guys love this stuff and want to hop in a case again tomorrow night, I have one more case. Those auctions are live now. We'll have five cases of Topps Chrome Black Baseball next week, and I think seven or eight cases of Bowman. Aaron James Savali, Quinn Priester. Jordan Adams. Dylan Cease, Clubhouse Collection Patch. That's my boy. That's my boy. I think he finally got a dub yesterday because I didn't bet him. I bet him in his first two starts. He got touched up a little bit. DC, congrats, DC spot. 
Jose. Come on, give us some chrome action. Those are the ones that get me excited. He's on the Padres now. He's on the pods now, Murgy. Come on, man. You should know that better than me. Woodruff. Dean Kramer. Dylan Cease is out. Out in San Diego in a nice pitcher's park. Still giving up home runs to crappy hitters. Kierstad. Mark Kana. Winans. Once Dylan Cease figures out that he doesn't have to strike every batter out, it's really going to help him. Julio. Chicago's trying to rebuild, but, man, I don't... Doesn't look very promising. Gary Sanchez. Jordan. Jose. Bryce Harper, Bybee Brady Singer, Palencia. The Cubs have been scoring some runs, at least. Good team to bet the over on so far. Bieber, News. All right, four boxes in. Still waiting for something massive. First auto wasn't bad. Endy's all right. Not, not going to set the world on fire, but not a horrible one. I think the Julio in the prior box was an image variation because it had a different. It had a different image than the one pulled. Very possible. Very possible. Ellie De La Cruz, box loader, all card ship, so you will get every single card. All of the image variations and stuff like that that I catch while sorting will be sleeved and top loaded, obviously. So if you catch them while I'm going, at least while they're within the same box, I'll go back and, and grab them. What am I going to do with the no spot buybacks? What do you mean by that, Anthony? Every spot that was on the checklist was listed. Are there no spot surprise buybacks in the products? Luciano, Tom Cosgrove. Jordan Lawler, Dane Myers, Leoti, Dick Williams. Henry Davis, Colton Cosner, Oviedo. Paul Goldschmidt, white border. Michael Harris, the second. Otani, insert, Friedel. I tend to agree with you. The Bulls have been the Bulls have been brutal for a while too. And they actually have a nice roster. Here we go. Marlins, Braxton Garrett out of 375. Mason Wynn, Kerry Carpenter. Again, if you guys catch an image variation or something that I don't, just let me know. Go right back. I think both Julio's I saw had the same. But I could be completely wrong on that. It has been a long day of travel for me to get back home. So there's a chance that I'm wrong on that. Taiwan Walker and Trey Turner. Jared Kelnick. Burger, Stanton highlights, Helinsta, what's up, Sparky, Kyle Gibson, Joey Weimer again, didn't we already pull that card, White Border, Joey Weimer, 
two out of the same case, huh? It's kind of annoying. Unless you have the Joey Wainer spot. David Hamilton. Sean Murphy. Terang. Tommy Henry. SP. Abreu. That's your boy. You got to have a bunch of his autos, don't you? Max Scherzer. Speaking of autos, let's see an auto out of this box, huh? Joe Rye. B. Will. Trey Cabbage. Lindor, Altuve. Austin Riley. Haney. Is it Quas and Kinzone? Yelly. Lugo. Bench and Tucker. Gossman, Strider. Do you really? You got four red out of fives. Which ones? Bowman's or... Josiah Gray and Adley. Owen White, Wisdom. Jeff McNeil. Patch and Logan Webb. Jeff McNeil. Patch. Eh. Yelly again, Justin Martinez. Bryce Alder. Nice. The base youth quake right out of five is a cool hit. Calhoun. Cole Calhoun. I haven't seen a Cole Calhoun card in a while. Soler, Kiebert Ruiz, and Garrett Mitchell. Stowers. Lofton, Reynolds, Nolan Arenado. So we're four to one relics so far. Andy Rod is the only auto out of the case. We have a hot box already. The auto actually came out of the hot box. If you joined us late, Tark Scooble, Martin Maldonado, Bobachet, Michael Conforto. Clark Schmidt Black Border. Med Rosario. What was he an update? McCovey. All right, five boxes in. Still waiting on a monster. Still waiting on a monster. Nice Ellie. Out there. Box topper buybacks not on checklist. Jim Palmer. Which ones would be not on the checklist? Jim Palmer. All right. Box six. This will get us to the halfway point of the case. Mackenzie Gore. Yeah, that was a good rookie class for the Brewers. 
Charlie Blackman. Wolf. Ooh, out of 75, Reds. Matt McClain, that could have been a huge alley. Nice still, Matt. Still a nice Matt Mac rookie cup out of 75. Chrome black parallel. Nice one there. I like that card. I like that. Get that up here once we re set up the wall in Thomas and Tanya. That one got me excited once I saw Reds. That could have been a monster. Astros, Dusty Baker, White Border. All right, this box is starting fun. Why? Who are you going after? Freilich? Clay Holmes, Hank Aaron, Reed Detmers. Baseball extra, no hitter. Okay, Brian Hayes. Classe, Mullen, Soriano, Willie, Saya. Yeah, they brought. Oh, you think? I don't know. I don't think Jackson will be. Maybe he will be. I think they have enough to. I think they might save him for Chrome Update. I think maybe they may actually save him all the way for Update. Although I don't know what else they'll have for Series Two then. So you might be right. Giancarlo Stanton, SP. Yeah, he'll be. You're right. You're right. Update might be rough. There's Tukey. I thought the first Tukey that we hit was, uh, <laughs> was something special. And it wasn't. It was just that same exact card. Altman, Enrique. Nestor Cortez, Christopher, what's up? Taj Bradley, Fujinami, Peraza. Clubhouse Collection Relic. That means five relics and one auto through the first half of the case. Unless we get lucky and catch a relic and an auto, but I doubt that's happening. LPM, what's up? What's going on, Christopher? How you been? Ball as well. Bryce Harper, Corbin Carroll. Max Scherzer, white border. Robert Garcia. Juan Soto. Red Schoendienst. Man, I want to pull a Juan Soto auto for you. Would be so nice. Tark Scoobal. Kevin Newman. SP Libertor. Cacasas. Basab. Clark Schmidt. Dominic Fletcher. Freddie Freeman, Noel V. Marte. Gregory Soto, Harrison Bader, Salvi. Again, if you're watching the break and you think we miss an image variation, they're going to be hard for me to catch. I have not ripped a case of this yet, so 
unless we pull the same image pretty close to one another. I may not catch it in the live. Either way, all cards do ship. So I will catch it when I'm sorting. As I'm looking at all the cards of the same player, it will be very easy to see. They're going to have to save one of those, Eric. Nolan Shanwell. <laughs> I know you would, Jaran. I just don't see how you put them both in there. I don't know what's going to be left for update. Robbie Grossman, Juan Yepes, Brian Bello. I guess that would make sense. That would make sense. Jordan Romano, Hassan Kim. Nick Allen. Gunnar Henderson, insert Austin Meadows. All right, we're halfway home. Again, thanks for joining. Hope you guys enjoy the break. Most products, I'm pretty knowledgeable about it. This is a new one for me, so appreciate those of you guys on Instagram and YouTube. Let me know what some of this stuff is. Gotta learn somehow. Gotta learn somehow. We are a huge WWE and baseball channel. Never really ripped Series 1 until this year either. Usually stay away from a lot of the heavy paper products, but we ripped a ton of Series 1 this year. We're going to rip a ton of Series 2. We're going to start ripping just about everything, so got to learn them. Most of them, they're 1975 cards. There are buybacks like Rich Hebner. I assume he's probably not on the checklist, so they're just throwing these in. If these aren't on the checklist, they'll be randomly thrown in with people's shipments because they're not staying here. Domingo, Domingo's auto would be nice. Yeah, if there's any of these that weren't on the checklist because there were some buybacks on the checklist, I'll double check them, but either way, they're not going to stay here. They'll go out to somebody in the break. Stuff that isn't on the checklist that's a, a surprise will get sent out to somebody. Either be somebody who skunks, or if nobody skunks, it'll go randomly to somebody who doesn't hit anything. So we'll toss them in. We'll toss them in for you. That's what we'll do with them. We always throw extra cards here when we can anyway. If you check our feedback, we're the best in the business at throwing extra cards in for people. We never let anybody skunk here, so that is what we will do with them. Jose Barrios, I wasn't aware that there were cards that weren't on the checklist. That's a cute thing Fanatics does. There's no reason, really. Just throw them right on the checklist, and then everybody knows. I'm just glad some of the checklists are starting to come out before the products. What was the last one that we ripped? Archive Signature Series. The checklist came out like nine days after the product. That's cute. And it turned out to be the worst product they ever printed, of course. Pavetta, CJ Abrams. He had a homer the other day. Kershaw. Missed one there. Glaber. Riley Adams, Soler, Ruiz, Marcus Simeon. Yep, they stamped the old ones and bought a huge box of them and then just tossed them in randomly. So dumb. So dumb. Masataka Yoshida. But it would be a cool set to collect a bunch of so who knows It'd be hard to collect the set though if they don't tell you what's there mike nelson trout base sp travis what's up no rafael yet but just one auto so maybe you'll bring yourself some good luck clark schmidt b woo Johnny DeLuca. Lindor. Juan 
Juan Soto. Volpe. I think that might be the first Volpe I've seen. Craig Soto, Blade. Evan Carter, rookie. Trying to, ooh, red. Diamondbacks. Out of 575, Slade Ciccone. Rookie Chrome. I love the Chromes. The Chromes are the most exciting thing in here for me. I love them. Slade Ciccone, congrats. Out of 575. 116 out of 575. All right, now let's find an auto. So used to seeing red being out of five, I got excited. And I was like, wait a minute. I think, gold's, I think gold might be out of five in this, in the chrome, if I read the checklist right. McClanahan, Jack Flaherty. Yeah, I could see him being one. Jaws. It's the third Jaws news flashbacks card. Again, welcome to everybody on Instagram and YouTube. We're in box seven. If you joined us late, we'll do a recap of the hits at the end. We'll get them shipped out to you within a couple business days, like always. If you love this stuff and want to see another case, I'll be back tomorrow night at the exact same time with our second and final case. Yeah, I can't see a scenario where they would do that. Can you, Eric? Carlson and Yon Mokata. Lawrence Butler. Earl Weaver, Liam Hendricks, Estevez, Tatis, Westberg. Declan Cronin. Grossman, Henry D. Jake Rogers, Josh Naylor. Miguel Amaya. Marco Luciano, nice one there. Max Fried. Nice Luciano. White Border. Dane Dunning, Devin Williams, Morgan and Soto, Chris Bassett, Max Meyer, Otani, that's the same photo I believe, Brady Singer, Merrill Kelly, base SP, and our first Jason Dominguez, first Dominguez. Wild. And maybe there was another Domingos, but that's the first one I can remember, which is crazy. Big old checklist here. Bieber, Nemo, Jake Mack. Last pack, box seven. B Marsh. Jack Sawinski, Stanton, Steele. Adley Rutschman, box topper. Box eight, here we go. Austin Wells. Kershaw, Fletcher. Bybee, Ty France, base SP, Saya. Austin 
Austin Riley. Byron Buxton, white border. Again, there are throwback uniform variations, so keep an eye out for those. Most of the hits should be in this eight spot from what I saw, from what I watched earlier. Lexi Diaz, Mookie Betts, Shane Mack, Nestor Cortez, There's nothing huge yet. Um, nothing huge yet. Andy Rod's the only auto. Ellie White border. McLean out of 75. Otherwise, I don't know. Joey Weimer. Base SP. <laughs> I can't do it tonight. No, no quarterback talk tonight. I'm not. Uh, you got to get me all riled up for that. I'm not all riled up tonight. Not all riled up. Catch me on a Friday during a lousy case. We might go. We might go movie quotes. We might go. Ellie, we might go movie quotes. We could go quarterback rant. I do think this draft, I will say, I do think this draft is for what everybody else seems to think is this incredible quarterback draft. I think there's going to be some teams that are Mauricio Dubon. I think there's going to be some teams that are really upset in about three years. And by that, I mean just about all of them that draft a quarterback this year. Lawler, Tony Gonsolini, Juan Soto, I'm not big on any of these quarterbacks personally, but that's why I do what I do. They do what they do, but I'm not. Uh, the kid from LSU I like. I like his upside. He's the only one I would want on my roster. 23 highlights. Kershaw, white border. That's a cool looking card, actually. Twenty twenty. Oof. I think it's a terrible quarterback class. I think it's a very overrated quarterback class. You're not a fan of Danny Dimes? I don't know anybody who's a fan of Danny Dimes at that contract. News flashbacks. Salvi. Can they get rid of? Yeah, I like Daniels from LSU. He's about the only one I would... Be wanting to take a shot on. He's, it looks like he's going to go, what, second? Gunnar Henderson, that. I think that's a different card, different image than the last one I saw. Kyle Bradish, but it might not be. I have no idea. You guys tell me if there's a place to find if that's an image variation, but I'm going to sleeve and load it just in case. No, it's just a base SP out of 20, card number 24, I think. I think the Steelers had a great offseason. To land Russell Wilson and Fields, they completely stole Justin Fields, Cole Reagans. I mean, I don't know what the Bears were doing. Like, nobody else, they couldn't get a better offer for that. I mean, Fields was... Whew. The problem with the guy like Caleb Williams or with going to an organization that's not set up for success, by that I mean general manager, coach, all the way down is if you're not a generational quarterback, it's really hard to go to a bad situation like that and not look terrible. Matt Manning. I mean, God, even Peyton Manning was awful in his first year. But, I mean, was able to turn it around, and obviously they drafted really well. O'Neal Cruz, 
I don't know if that's anything special. I feel like I've seen a couple of Neil Cruz's already. Again, any image variations that I catch while sorting will obviously be sleeved and loaded regardless of player. Uh, we caught a couple in what? What did we catch a couple in? Eric, what was the last product that we ripped that had all the confusing ones? I What I don't like about Caleb Williams is I, he couldn't win any big games or even marginal games in college. That's a problem for me. Slade Ciccone with two numbered cards. What are the odds of that? I just, I, I mean, and he, it's not like he didn't have any talent around him. Big League. Yeah, we caught a couple variations of Big League. No, it wasn't, maybe it wasn't Big League. Slade Ciccone numbered out of 375. I just, I would have liked to see him win. And, not, and, you know, he looked terrible against Notre Dame last year. And it's like, eh. Yeah, there is, Travis. This is the relic. I'm going to blame that one on you, Travis. You just jinxed us into the relic of Nico Horner. Bat relic, Red Schoendienst. He sure did. I don't know. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll prove me wrong. I mean, there's there's a lot of scouts who've said he's better talent-wise, a better prospect than Patrick Mahomes was at this time. So, hey, you know, but there's a lot of scouts that said Jamarcus Russell was a surefire Hall of Famer. So, you know, it's just – and I love the kid from Michigan – like I think he's, I think he was one of the most average talents I've ever seen play at the quarterback position. But people are like, oh, oh, he had a great pro day. It's like, yeah, it's scripted. He better have a great pro day. Like, what are we talking about here? He threw for like sixty yards in the first half of the national title game. I think he might have thrown for a buck. I think he might have thrown for like a buck twenty in the whole game. Uh, there's a, one box that has one purple in every pack, Travis. Stadium Club, Wingmouth. That's what it was. Thank you, Wingmouth. My well, man. That's what we found a couple. Yeah, we found like a Bryce Harper that, that nobody caught during the live that we shipped out. In one of the cases, which was awesome. That was fun to find while sorting. I was like, oh, man. I can't believe we missed this. Yeah, that was Stadium Club. Thank you, Wingmouth. I didn't even know you were there. Love to see it. I agree, Ryan Baker. But he's a nice kid, smart kid. Good quarterback at that level. I just whoever trades up and 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 spends a first rounder on him, like that's the problem, is everybody gets too quarterback happy. If if there's no quarterback, do I think Aaron Rodgers will look anything like his former self? I haven't followed the Jets, Jay Khan, in the offseason, but if that offensive line – I sadly, we had to watch a lot of Jets football last year in primetime, and I can't get away from it, so I watched just about every one of those games. If that offensive line – I and I mean isn't – and when I say improved, if that's not completely overhaul improved, that was probably the worst offensive line I've ever seen at, at this level, like – that poor kid had no chance. I mean, uh, granted, he's not great, but man, uh, man, that was brutal. Was that five seventy five Quinn Priester Chrome? He had absolutely no chance for success behind that line. And like every time they'd get a drive going, guy would miss a miss an assignment, blindside sack, fumble. I mean, it was it was hard to watch. <laughs> Jay ran. I see what you did there. Uh, but do I think Rogers will look anything like his former self? <sighs> I don't know. I really, I hope so. It's good for the league when he's, it's good for the league. You started, Travis started this. Travis started it. No, the O'Neill was not a short print. Jonah Heim, he went yard yesterday. Jared Triolo. Jonah Heim, white border, all-star. But that Jets D is really good, so they've got a running game. But they need some help on that line. I don't know what they did. I don't know if they addressed it at all. SD bros, what's up? Dylan Carlson, Corbin Carroll, New Age Performers. Now I'm, like, looking for different jerseys. If I'm new into cards, what's the best set to start buying? That's a tough question. What kind of cards do you like? Baseball? Corbin Carroll. Did you?
Craig Kimbrell, Jake Berger, Joe Kelly, Bobby Miller. I like Joe Kelly. He's a tough dude. Baseball. Oh, I don't know. It's a tough, that's a loaded question. It depends. Like, new into cards for what purpose? For collecting them, for buying them to resell? Are you buying them for your kids to get into? Usually, there's Connor Joe. Usually, flagship tops is a good place to start. Um, you can get hobby boxes at a pretty good price. You can get hobby jumbo boxes at a pretty good price with a guaranteed auto, depending on the year. So it just kind of depends if, you know, depends how deep you want to dive in. But if you're just starting out, you know, there's some good products. A lot of hanger boxes of top stuff and retail. If you're a big Pokemon collector and thinking about starting a sports collection too. Who do you collect? You have a team or you have some players you like? Gabriel Arias, base SP. This is one of the more collectible products there are out there. I mean, people love this stuff if you're into building sets. Reese Olsen, white border rookie. Andrew Abbott, Foots McGee. Still only one auto out of the case, which is not ideal. Any Dallas teams? Yeah, I would start with I would start with flagship tops. There's Josh Lau, Jeff McNeil. Tops Chrome is always a great set to start with. That'll come out at some point this summer. Yes, sir, they do, Travis. Huston, Kierstad. Ronald Acuna Jr. Rangers are your favorite sports franchise. I mean, Series 1 from this year has got Evan Carter. Evan Carter, rookie. So does this. I mean, I would start with some of the more affordable products. Heritage, Stadium Clubs, Jameson Tyone. Heritage, Series 1, Stadium Clubs. Chrome starts to get a little more expensive, especially with a rookie class like this one. Yeah, that's what we we're just talking about, Travis. And you'll have a uh, what's his name? There's Jordan Romano. You'll have the kid from. You'll have Langford too for one of those. Langford, yeah, you're gonna have Langford's gonna be in either series two or update later this year. MJP, Wyatt Langford for your Rangers. So, yeah, dive in slowly. Don't just go out and buy a bazillion boxes a hobby and figure out what you like open a little bit of everything there's definitely it's a nice time to get into the hobby because you can actually buy retail now joe ryan so you can find like hanger boxes of this probably at your local walmart and target whereas about two years ago two years ago everybody was fist fighting each other trying to grab all the retail so now you can actually buy cards again which is nice mike trout insert no relic yet in this one, right? Give us an auto, please. Yeah, Chrome's going to be expensive. Bowman's expensive. Pre-sale prices are up significantly over last year. Shane Mack. Jonathan Joseph India. Riso. Yeah, the Giants had a rough O line too, but they just were so injured too all year. Teoscar Hernandez, Bat Relic. We need an auto, man. That's what. Are these really, are cases really only yielding one or two autos of this? I was told there's not a lot of autos, but I kind of expected that meant like three or four. Big League had three or four. <laughs> I'll probably still throw some of those. I'll probably throw some of those on. Instagram, to be honest. Fall of Saigon, the Vietnam War ends. News flashbacks. Celebrity cut autos, news flashbacks. This is definitely an interesting product. This is my first foray into it. I'll be honest, I don't personally love the lack of hits, but I do really like the chromes. So I 
think you can, I think there's some big chases in here. There's Ron Hodges, another one of these buybacks. Well, maybe I'll just random these off at the end of the break. We've got three of them so far. Maybe we'll just random these off if anybody wants them. I don't know if they have any. I don't know what the value on those is, but there's Hebner. So in some of these boxes, instead of giving us a darn box loader or the chance of an auto, they're giving us an old, an old buyback card with a big old stamp on it. Big old stamp. All right, we got three boxes left to go. We better see at least one more auto, please. Andy Rod's got the only auto so far. A couple of Reds players have nice, nice hits, but otherwise, not a lot of action. Quick boom. Julio and Mickey Moniak. Maybe there was a Julio image variation back there. I feel like I've seen that specific card twice. I don't remember the third Julio. Maybe it was. I hope it was an image variation. That would be fantastic. Michael Soroka, base SP. I think the team everybody thinks is really going to take a big jump this year in the NFL that isn't is the Atlanta Falcons, Nick Lofton, Brian Reynolds, Tyler Wells. I think everybody thinks immediately because they got Kirk Cousins coming off a pretty crazy injury. I think immediately everyone's like, oh, they're, they're just going to be so good. I don't really think their skill position guys are as good as everybody else does. But I like Bijan, but he's not an every down back. I don't know. Call me crazy. I was right on that division last year. I told you the Bucks would win that division last year, and they did. I don't know. The Bucks got everybody back. And they draft really well. MJP, good to meet you as well. Charlie Blackman, so another relic, bat relic. Jeez, oh man. So we got two boxes left for a chance at another auto. We better get at least one more. Charlie Blackman, bat relic, clubhouse collection. Oosh. Lawrence Butler. White border of Eli Morgan. Okay, Eli. These relics are Obi's fault. I agree. Dusty Baker and Devin Sweet. Devin Sweet's always in the front. I think we got a Chrome card in here. Marlins out of 575. 157 out of 575. Actually, so... I was thinking that one was a red, but it wasn't. It was just red because of the team color. Luis Arise, congrats to the Arise spot on something numbered. Slow case, I would assume. Let's see if we can't find something fun on the way out. Two and two and some change boxes left. Earl Weaver, Stratton, Yelly, Winans. True. You can't blame me for the original six. Just these three. Those ones are definitely on you. Now, I heard earlier from a buddy of mine who rips this that the, they were pretty relic heavy. I think the odds say, what, one in 110 packs on an auto? I'm not great at math, but what's that, one in four or four and a half boxes? White border. Let's see, this is on the checklist. Is that Corey? <laughs> they did. It was all planned. Otani Outman. Hernandez, Burp, Lie, Levin, Miguel Cabrera, Corey Seager, Taiwan Walker, Luke Weaver, Base SP, Real Muto, Tony 
Dane Dunning. <laughs> so the base SPs do still have numbered parallels, right, Eric? There's Yoshida, Gavin Williams. Yoshida Rookie Cup. That could have been an image variation. Whit Merrifield. I haven't seen Travis in a live break in a while, so I'm happy to have him back here. Especially not with the relic, just not with the relics. Got to give us a red ink auto for making us suffer with only one auto through 10 boxes. Devin Williams, Cal Rally, Aaron Judge. Is that the same Judge? Johan Rojas. Alcantara. <laughs> I don't know if it will. Harold Ramirez, base SP, and Cade Marlowe. rough go with what the breaks or just the day Swinski, eddie rosario Matty o rider ryan max kepler vinnie p Carlos Santana base SP. AJ Smith Shaver. All right. Oswaldo Cabrera. I'm sorry to hear that, Travis. I saw that post earlier. I am sorry to hear that. That's never, never a good day or week or probably most of the month. My heart goes out to you. I'm going to take a 30 second break. We'll finish the last two boxes here momentarily, guys. Boxes left to go. We'll random off those other cards that we didn't know were on the checklist at the end. Oh, yeah, that's terrible, Travis. How old was the dog? Morris Nettles will get randomed off as well. Two boxes left to go. Got to see at least another auto. Ugh. Yeah, my dog is about to turn nine as well. Manny Machado. That sucks so bad. I'm so sorry to hear that. Jay Hams, what's up? Descalfani. Jake Cave and another LA base on the back.
Nemo, Luis Matos whiteboard, a nice one there. Man, the Giants can't score at all. I think they just scored some runs yesterday, but man, what a rough start to the season. What a rough start to the season it's been for them. <laughs> I hope there is one, man. I really do. Yeah, man, get some rest. Maybe I'll surprise you with the message that the red ink, if there is one, goes your way. Just want to see an auto. At this point, I'm just hoping not to see a... <laughs> At this point, I'm just hoping not to see another relic. Blue. Jordan Walker. It's not blue. It's just her. Chrome to 575, Jordan Walker. Man, Jordan Walker was not good to us in last year's products. I feel like he was an SP in everything, and they just didn't tell us. Either that or we just didn't pull Jordan Walker ever. Austin certainly knows that. We didn't hit him any Jordan Walker. Smith Schauber, Lamonte Wade Jr., Kyle Freeland. For the multiplayer cards, we rolled so we rolled a die earlier. Um, it came up three. It was a twelve sided die. Any of the dual player cards, if there's dupes, I'll split them up amongst the player spots. If there's only one, it'll go to the one on the left or the top because of the three. If there's the four player cards, it'll go to the top left. But again, I'll split those up if there's multiples of them and send them to all the player spots. I know this is a big set collector's product, so. I will do my best to make sure everybody gets, depending on what is here in the sort, but like that would go here. And we did that at the very beginning of the break, if you missed it. Moustakis, Andres Jimenez. So if they're giving us another auto, it's in the final box. Jeez, oh man. One auto, one stinking auto. Out of 11 boxes, I guess that would be when I give a reason why I don't break this stuff. It's because it's not really all that exciting. I wish it was more exciting. I really do. I usually like to rip the more exciting products. I don't rip crazy expensive stuff, but, you know, the mid-range stuff that at least you get a couple numbered cards and an auto per box. Another Julio, but we've seen that one. One auto and all these relics. It's just crazy that they produce a case like with just one auto in it. Jack Flaherty, Pete Crow. Sorry, guys. I don't know what's. This is not a great introduction for my first case of this. Maybe tomorrow night's case will be absolutely insane. It better be. How many autos are you seeing, J-Ran? Out of a case. Bryce Terang, JP, Juan Pablo. Brandon Williamson, nice. Gunnar Henderson, Nolan Jones, White Border, SP. Oswaldo Cabrera. Madrigal. Yount. Ryan Weathers. Cole Reagans. Luciano. Zach Gallon. Base SP. Winans. Eloy. Nesky, Santander SP, Palencia, Blackman, Caminero, JP Sears. That looks like a what, like a black and white photo SP. That's got to be something. 
photo's black and white on that one. It's the first one I've seen like that. So the J.P. Sears spot, that is one of the variations. The black and white photo variation. I can't believe I caught that. Aaron Judge. Black and white photo variation. See, like that stuff's that stuff's too confusing. George Kirby, SP, Alcantara. Four boxer had four relics. So yeah, I mean it's possible that autos are just very tough to come by in this, but and that's what I was told. Spencer Strider, Cade Marlowe. All right, give us a nice red ink auto for somebody on the way out. On this last one, please. Last box. Again, thanks to you guys for joining. Hope you enjoyed yourself despite the not incredible case so far. See if we can fix it for somebody on the way out. Another one of these. Joe Ferguson. Stamped. We'll quickly random these off at the end of the break so we know who's getting them. It's insane to me that they threw those in. All right. Big auto. Come on. Jeez, oh, man. That seems like an insane pull <laughs> at this point, given 11 boxes with just one auto. The Johnny Bench and Ellie, I saw the duel is a redemption. But it's nice to know that Johnny's signing, so I'm sure that'll get filled. Good luck on the final box. Stay tuned for a quick recap. And we'll random off these buybacks that were not on the checklist. At least if you didn't hit anything, at least you had a chance of catching one of those. Kiebert Ruiz, Bailey Falter, Emmett Sheehan. Kyle Harrison. Jesus Lizardo, Zach Wheeler. Juan Soto. Taiwan Walker, Stu Fairchild, Yohan Moncada, take the strikeouts over. What is it? Probably five and a half. Joe Rye, Otani highlights. Bryce Elder. Cole Reagans again. He got an extra day of rest, too. There's a Contreras. There's not a lot of action in terms of a ton of ton of base cards in this either with how big the checklist is. I think I've only seen like three Ellie's. Jordan Walker, Max Fried. All right, come on, give us an auto. Hunter Goodman, Morell, Adley Rutschman, auto. Nice. Congrats to the Adley spot. All right, that's a pretty darn good auto. We'll take that. Nice Adley. Nice. Adley on the way in. Congrats to the Adley spot. Let's see if we can't get a nice chrome hit on the way in here, too. Yeah, that would have been nice last year, too. I do like to see him still signing on card stuff. It's nice. 
Rafaela, Mike Trout, Dominguez. That's only the second Dominguez I've seen. It's wild. Horner. Caminero, Slade. Slade got two hits. Cobb and Jake Mack. Willie, Austin Wells. That's a nice one. That spot. People like Austin Wells. White border, Austin Wells. There you go. That'll play. All in all, I feel like the case wasn't all that exciting. My apologies. I wish it was a better case. Maybe tomorrow night's will be nuts. So I would like to know. I'm going to have to watch through a case recap or two and see what the average number of autos per case is. Got to be between two or three based on the odds. Austin Hayes, Javi Baez. Again, all cards do ship. Any image variations or anything like that that I catch while sorting will be sleeved and loaded. Tukey Toussaint. Your cards will get to you safely and securely. Again, thanks so much for joining the break. We'll random off these buybacks here at the end t ward kwan henry victory leader so that'll go to the eflin spot come on chrome There we go. Garrett Cole out of $9.99. Jordan Westberg. I was asking for Chrome. Got one. It's just a base. Non-refractor. Garrett Cole. Lake Sable. Kowser. John Gray. Kimbrell. Margaret Thatcher. News. Eloy. Dom Smith. B. Wu. Charlie. Wolf. Austin Wells again. Lindor. Last pack coming. Our show. Ronald. Evan Carter closes us out. All right, recap time. Here we go. Relics. Jimenez, Charlie Blackman, Teoscar, Nico Horner, Oswald Peraza, McNeil, Dylan Cease, William Contreras, and Real Muto. Garrett Cole to 9.99. Victory leaders: Austin Wells, White Border. J.P. Sears is a black and white photo variation. Gunnar Henderson, White Border. Jordan Walker, Refractor to 5.75. Matos and who is that? Is that Corey Seager? Can't even tell. We'll figure that out. White Border arise to 5.75. Eli Reese Olson and Jonah Heim are all white borders. Quinn Priester to 5.75. Slade Sacconi to 3.75. Gunnar Henderson base SP. SPs of Kershaw, Buxton, and Luciano. Those are all white borders. Slade Sacconi to 5.75. Berrios, Scherzer, Dusty Baker, white borders. Clark Schmidt, black border. That is Seeger. So yeah, that was a Corey Seeger. Joey Weimer, Braxton Garrett to 375. Goldschmidt, Batty, and Forrest Wall are white borders. Nito, black border. Severino, white border. Gunnar Henderson. That might be an image variation on the purple. Or maybe it's just they all are. But it's definitely different than the other. Yogi Bear out, white border. Mookie, Giloff, Priester Purples. Yuri to 375, Matos, Sheehan, Jordan Adams, Brian Wu, Purples from the Hot Box, Acuna, Weimer, 
Goldschmidt and this Tukey Toussaint that I thought was something special, and it wasn't. And then on the wall, Ellie De La Cruz, white border. Matt McLean to 75, Chrome. Jordan Westberg to 375, Chrome. Autos, Andy Rodriguez and Adley Rutschman. Nice one there. Give me just a minute. We'll random off these other ones for you. That way everybody knows who's getting these five. Just let me download the checklist. It's going to take about two minutes if you want to see who's getting these. It's possible chasing the dream. It's definitely possible. It'll all ship. Just give me a second here to get this checklist downloaded and get the duplicates pulled out of here so we can random these off. All right, here we go. We're going to roll some dice. I'm going to put this checklist in here. There we go. Just 80 million spots in there. All right. First one is Morris Nettles. We're randoming four times. It's going to take a few minutes. So many cards on here. If it lands on a dual spot, it will go to the first name. And the fourth one, Dominic Smith. You got Morris Nettles. Tim Foley's up next. We're going eight times on Tim Foley. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And the eighth time will get us to 12 totals. Camilla Duvall. You got Tim Foley. Buyback next up is Rich Hebner. We're going four times. Here's the fourth and final time. Kyron Paris, you got Rich Hebner. Next up is Ron Hodges. Nine times. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, and number nine, Devin Williams. You're getting Ron Hodges. And last up, Joe Ferguson. Seven times, and we'll find out who gets Joe Ferguson. 
two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Evan Longoria, you've got Joe Ferguson coming your way. Again, thanks everybody for joining the break. I'll get these shipped out to you in the next couple of days. We'll get them sorted. Any image variations or anything like that that we find that nobody caught during the live, I'll send you a message if we find one. But all cards do ship. Uh, if you watch the break back and you catch something that we missed, shoot me a message. But either way, I'll catch them in the sort. Again, thanks so much for joining the break. We got one more case of this tomorrow night. Thank you so much for joining. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.